Hi, welcome to my lodge. You know, today I'm talking to you about perjury. Perjury is giving false information in a trial or judicial proceeding. In Nigeria, it is regulated by the Criminal Code in the South and the Penal Code in the North. Section 117 provides for the definition, like I said, and it also provides that it doesn't matter if the court is properly constituted or not at the tribunal, and it also doesn't matter if it's made on oath or not. It also doesn't matter if it's made orally or in writing. And in a situation where the punishment involves death or life imprisonment, and you come to light to the court or give give perjury to the court, you will be liable to imprisonment for life. Section 118 provides for 14 years imprisonment for perjury. Section 119 provides that a minimum of one witness is necessary to corroborate the offense of perjury. Section 120 down to 123 provides to related situations with regards to false information to the court. If you destroy an evidence or if you pay someone to come and lie to the court, or if you encourage the giving of false information to a court, you are liable to a felony. However, I must say that perjury is distinct from forgery. Section 463 of the Criminal Code provides for three years imprisonment when you forge a certificate or a document. And Section 362 to 364 of the Penal Code provides for punishment of 14 years with regards to forgery with documents and any other certificate. I hope you've enjoyed today's show. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And I hope you have a sweat time. Bye. Nothing.